guys we are back with our next tutorial in this tutorial let's see all about soil pollution okay in the previous tutorials we have learned all about marine water and air so in this tutorial let's see what is soil pollution soil pollution is defined as the change in physical chemical and biological conditions of soil through man activities resulting in degradation of quantity quality and productivity of soil okay basically soil pollution is caused by many factors guys there is not one or two even there are many causes okay let's check out types of soil pollution it is basically divided into two types mainly agricultural soil pollution and soil pollution due to effective wastes or something like that okay basically i didn't write any examples here so let's try to write some examples on them okay let's go through them basically let's go through agricultural soil pollution agricultural soil pollution pollution of surface pollution of surface soil okay surface soil can be polluted by these both include usage of fertilizers and pesticides guys to be clear even it causes surface pollution and it causes underground pollution underground of underground of soil a lots and lots of pollution guys whenever we go to industries for industries it is going to be for surface it is just throwing off of uh, waste materials waste materials which are unwanted waste materials if we just throw them off on the surface of the soil it causes pollution and internal pollution it include it may be due to the industrial wastes like chemicals which can easily damage the soil and they can enter into the soil and damage a lot even interior parts so this is the types of soil pollution and these are the causes of soil pollution basically okay let's go through example so that it will be a bit more clear for you okay causes of soil pollution soil pollution is caused due to acid rains acid rains i told you about it so acid rains even causes soil pollution and any kind of accidents okay even any kinds of accidents even cause soil pollution yes and deforestation everyone should know this that the so everyone knows that the cultivation go cultivation is done on soil something like that okay so they and we'll be having some fertile land we will be calling that fertility so only 2.5 cm of the upper layer of the soil is the most fertile soil guys the lower part is just soil that's it the only the upper part is the most fertile soil and whenever an accident or something happens there it is going to just move off and there is no chance of growing crops properly so causes of accidents also causes soil pollution even deforestation throwing of nuclear wastes mining and industries industrial activities oil and fuel dumping yes electronic waste like batteries yes agricultural practices such as application of pesticides herbicides and fertilizers the main reason disposal of coal ash i hope everyone know about this coal ash while well, generation of electricity will be getting electricity from burning of coal after burning the coal the left out thing is just like a powder that is called as a coal ash okay guys i hope everyone is clear with effects sorry causes of soil pollution so now let's go through effects of soil pollution okay soil pollution it reduces soil fertility which we have discussed above which is 2.5 cm the only fertile land it reduces nitrogen fixing so nitrogen fixing is a property that i hope everyone know that in our surroundings we will be having at most maximum percent is nitrogen and nitrogen is one of the most important protein or nutrient for plants they'll be taking off nitrogen and they'll be leaving off nitrogen and it's a huge cycle guys we'll be discussing in one chapter in some chapter i hope i remember in second chapter maybe we'll be discussing about this don't worry guys be cool we're going to go through it so it reduces nitrogen fixation and large loss of soil and nutrients yes soil pollution causes loss of soil fertility which leads to loss of soil reduces crop yield yes we have discussed it 
next dangerous chemical entering underground water yes if there is if the soil is not so fertile and not so strong or something like that the dangerous gases can easily enter underground water which can easily affect the whole world okay reduce of pollutant gases and reduce the vegetation public health problems you're going to get many kind of diseases by eating the fruits or plants which are grown at that place okay nextly it causes food poisoning that's that's what i told you just now so let us see what are the steps that we can take to reduce water pollution sorry soil pollution so we need to follow reduce reuse recycle this is the main point in every topic we'll be having this this also afforestation should be done and soil waste treatment some methods should be implemented to purify the soil and waste use eco friendly eco friendly products guys so that it decreases the pollution stop using fertilizers and use manure products okay this is one of the main point and dangerous chemical usage should be decreased yes these dangerous uses and everything may cause you cholera and many kind of other diseases which are contaminated i hope everyone is clear with soil pollution so in the next tutorial let's see all about noise pollution thank you guys thanks for watching the video